How did you know to find me? He saw Bacon's chopper nearby. He's never down this far south, and I wanted to know why. Lucky for you, we were in the area when we got Darpan's text. Well, we're here. Welcome to Banapur. Home of the Golden Path. Who's this? Where's Darpan? He didn't make it. This is Ajay Gale. Mohan's son. Let me understand. Darpan's dead? Hmm? And you brought me this. I'm not involved in, in whatever this is. I'm just looking for Lakshmana. We're in the middle of a fucking war. We don't have time for tourists. What was I supposed to do? Just leave him there? I'm sorry, brother. Amita's a little touchy. I'll talk to her. As for Lakshmana, it sounds like it could be a temple or shrine. But if that's the case, it's in the north. The north is enemy territory, and we can't get you there. Not yet. Go and clear your head. Come find me when you're ready. Hmm? All right, so last time we we escaped Pig and Min's terrible base and almost got murdered or all that, or whatever the hell was about to happen there, necessarily. And we came into town, we were, we were brought here by Sabal, Amita wasn't very psyched to see us. I figured maybe we can try to reconcile with her, maybe we can impress her a bit if we go help out. So welcome to town. The people that are in conflict with Pagan. This is why we will prevail. We are leaving the mistakes of the past behind. It will take time for all the young fighters to get confident, to understand the drills, to get over the fear and confusion of war, but they will. They have to. The future of Kirat is at stake. So this is our first long game for the, the Patreon Game of the Month thing. So I gave you guys a poll to decide whether or not I should do the main story or do side content and the main story, with the idea being that it might take more or less than a month, given how, uh, how much I do. So if you're one of the people that, on the, that are, is the, a Patreon supporter, be sure to check your inbox, because right now it's tied. Sabal says, I shouldn't be doing this. I am teaching you to protect yourself. Ah, the tourist. I'm Amita. This is Badra. Hi. Keep working. Look, I overreacted back there. We're at war. We keep losing soldiers. The work keeps piling up. Is there anything I can do? I'm not a soldier, but I want to help. Okay. Sure. There's a farm not far from here. Kanan runs it, but she's old and she could use your help with some wild animals. <laughs> I need you to keep the hides intact, so use this. What are you... Pick it up. Try again. Very good. We got ourselves a bow. The Wolf's Den. So where's my bow at? Triangle doesn't do anything right now. Huh. Maybe I just can't use it when I'm in town. Ooh, an ATV. Hello. I think you guys... You guys... You actually, actually autopilot, don't you? So, left stick is how you steer, right trigger shoot. Oh, that's the first thing I pressed. Awkward. Uh, so it's Warthog controls, basically. Interesting. You can change your driving controls in the options menu. Driving and shooting. R2 is shoot. R1 is throwables. And you can activate auto drive with L3. That's worth noting because it'll mean that you kind of will follow a path automatically. There we go. So he's kind of maintaining his speed and continuing along the path, and I'm not actually pressing anything right now, which is kind of nice. I don't. It'll probably it probably won't be flawless because how how could it ever be? But it seems to already be better at uh, pathfinding than some of the stuff I've done with Roach in uh, in Witcher Three. All right, we're coming up on the location we're going for. So 
So auto drive is off now. Around here is supposed to be this old lady that needs help with the animals. This is my sword bow. Here we go. This will be interesting. Getting those uh those Tomb Raider vibes from the feeling of this this weapon. Hello there. Fuck. I'm impressed. Uh, Amita sent me over. She said you might have some kind of wild animal problem. Hey, Amita, I have no idea what I'm supposed to do here. <sighs> Wolves are a common nuisance for Canaan Farm. She's killed off a number of them, but this year they're especially aggressive, and I'm worried about her. There's a den nearby. Clear it out, huh? I think Kadon has supplies stockpiled somewhere on her farm that you can use. And Ajay, skin your kills. We can always use the pelts. She is just drinking and drinking and drinking away, isn't she? All right, impressive. She can put the way that she can put it away. I get the feeling that she's the kind of badass that would probably take all these wolves just fine on her own. But I'll help. Gotta make, gotta get that girl to stop hating me so much the moment I walk into town. Because I don't think I have a ton of friends around here. Wherever the hell I am. I also should have gotten back on my ATV. That would have been the smart thing to do. Oh well. I thought I was gonna slide down. There we go. Oh. Hello. Got him. Double skin for the clean kill. That's right, if you hit them really cleanly with an arrow, they suddenly have twice the skin. Oh wow, that was like a... That was really close to being a shot straight through the eye. I get it, of course. They, uh... You damage less skin, so you get more usable skin. Is, is what is the logic there. I just, I just find it amusing to call it double skin. Instead of not less than maximum skin. When they make it sound more like a bonus, it also makes it, it also makes a little bit less sense. Damn, you make a lot. This is a sat this is a satisfying currency. It's worth so little that it makes it feels like you're constantly making a fortune. Hey, random box, five grand. Whoa. There's a cliff. What? You want me to come here? All right. Let's remind ourselves about the camera real quick. We have wolves. Oh, an ATV. That'll be convenient for getting away. So there's already a wolf. Oh, multiple wolves on the way to that den. Alright. So I've owned this game for about a year. I bought it at launch. And for some reason didn't follow up on it. I think Assassin's Creed Unity put a bad taste in my mouth. And I didn't really want to deal with Ubisoft anymore for a little while. So I played the intro mission before. And I played this mission before, I think. And I don't know if I played any more than that. <laughs> What a great use of $60. At least it's kind of nice that you guys are getting me to play this again because it justifies my own purchases. Back in the old days where I didn't have to pay for rent so I could just throw $60 at something and be like, ah, oh, whatever. Stuff happened. Is that a body? That's a human body. That is a human body. All right. Concerning. Anything on her to identify her? Just, just a side reel? Alright. Oh, hey, bows. Bow arrows. <laughs> Bow arrows. Good job. I thought I could pick them up. Maybe I... Oh, I probably, I probably have maximum ammo right now and don't need them. Anyone else around besides the obvious two guys? Hey, Wolfie. Wolfie, 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 Wolfie. I missed. Alright. This might be harder than I thought. Yeah, it's a little hard to tell where the arrow's gonna go. Hello, friend. Come here. Right over here. There we go. It's way easier when they're coming straight at you. Yes, yeah, I'm not... I, I honestly don't even see the arrow move. Oh, God. <laughs> I just punched a wolf in the face. Ow. Get off of me. Ah. Uh. All right, well, that was off to a bad start. All right, I missed the shot. Missed it bad. And did not adapt well to the situation. <laughs> Get that wolf skin done. 
Alrighty, we're gonna have to learn how to how to aim arrows badly. Well, I know where I can find some more after after wasting them all like that. Someone else's unscavenged kill. There we go. I can't feel too bad because that person died. So I'm doing better than that. But it's, can you skin? I already skinned you, probably boars. Ooh, hello. That enough skins for you, lady? All right, so I'm probably gonna be using that to escape in a moment. Damn. Yeah, a little worried. Things might have gotten a little bit worse around here, huh? I already found two corpses. Yeah, this is. Well, wolves are a nuisance. She usually gets them herself, but you know, maybe there's a few too many now. And then everyone died. Hello. Explodey arrow. Hey, buddy. Oh, he's alive. <laughs> he charges right in your. That's a little intimidating. This comes right up in your face. All right. Wolves are fast. I know everyone's shocked. All right, guys. Coming this way. Any more surprises? Another another corpse. There you go. Cancel arrow. Hey, body. Don't mind me just looting all of your precious money. Grabbing your Molotovs. Alright. Equip fire arrows. So I assume that's what I use to blow up the barrel. So I'm going to want to not be in here when I do that. Anyone else coming after me, though? Any surprise wolves? No? So you said hold... Squ was it square to tri triangle for, tri for fire arrows? No? Shit, I already forgot how to fire arrows. Okay. Hunter bow. Arrow. No. Arrows. Oh, so there we go. So we go to square. I assume we want to shoot it at that explodey barrel. There we go. Anyone here to investigate the death of your lair? I think we got that. Thank you, convenient ATV that I keep trying to drive with the shooting button. Oh god. Wolfie, Wolfie, this is a bad place for you to be. How to drive, no signal, to indicate that I'm not on a road. Huh? Huh? Ooh. Sweet tricks, bro. Oh god. I apologize to the owner of this ATV who is probably dead from wolves, so... You know. It works out. Alright. I did it, Granny. You still putting away like 17 bottles of, war of rice wine? Hey. Badra, how are you? Good. I, uh, brought you these pelts. I thought maybe you could use them. Hmm. These are good, Ajay. But you keep them. She has enough for her Tanka paintings. I'm sorry, Tanka what? This one is about the life of a guru. This one is about the demon Yalung. This one is about the goddess Kira. And that one is about Badra, the next Tarun Matara. The Tarun Matara is a living goddess, if you believe Sabal. It's no life for a child, being treated as an object, thing. <sighs> Thanks for your help. Later? I'll show you how to put those to good use. All right, we went and skinned some wolves, and did not act they didn't actually need what we brought, but we did it. These are detailed. Actually looks comic book-like. A little bit weird to, to be uh, sort of idolizing a person, a child like a person. I mean, a child like a god. Kanan. One of my patrols reported that the livestock at your farm have been attacked by wolves again. I know you don't want our help, but please, we can take care of the den for you. The Golden Path owes you a lot, and I will not forget the sacrifices of previous generations. Amita. That's touching. But she was helpful for something. Are those guys friendlies? They're blue on the map, so I assume they're friendlies. Hey guys. Oh, bye. Nice meeting you. 
All right, let's warp over to town where we can find something else to do. Yay, fast travel. Always happy to see that it exists in a game. And we're back in town. Specifically inside of a building I haven't been in yet. It's probably my stronghold or my base that I haven't actually seen yet. All right. Something to read. Communal safe houses. Remember that the, that the safe houses are shared communal spaces for all Golden Path members. It's important that you leave each safe house in a clean and tidy state for the next soldiers. We all need to pitch in and help. Above all else, if you take anything from the trading post, you must leave money to cover the items. Lajnus helps with the supplies, but we need to pay him. We are not a charity, and supplies are scarce. Sabal. It's basically an excuse for the fact that in all these safe houses, there is just a straight-up store. Which is kind of a cool mechanic. So I can just come here. Wow, ah, oh, God. Okay, I get it, there's, up, there's new items. I've never been here before, you don't have- Oh, Jesus. Okay, that went on for a while. So you can refill all of your ammo. You can customize weapons, and you can sell stuff. I should probably sell anything. Let's see, quick sell. Uh, sell un unused loot. Crafting loot will be kept. Yes. That gets rid of the special stuff that's just kind of around you don't necessarily need. Mom's note. Age, AJ, or AJ, my son. I have so much left to say to you, but I'm out of time. Please, take me back to Laksham Lakshmana. The journey will tell you more than I ever could. I love you, and I will always be with you. Mom. Totally sounds like a vague message of like, Hey, go take, go on this spirit journey. F f discover your heritage. But in this case, it was a lot more, there was a lot more weight to that inference than, their than he probably was counting for. You can get more healing syringes. Uh, cost 10,000. I have zero out of three, so I should probably do that. Body armor cost 20,000. Then a whole bunch of stuff, like guns for hire. Oh, bunch of upgrades, sticky grenades. Interesting. Probably want to get some more syringes. Is it 10,000 each? Sure is, alright. A little rough. Refill ammo. That is kind of expensive. So I guess money really doesn't account, to, uh, account for much. Was there really nothing I wanted there? Not, not like a straight up weapon? Oh. Tabs. There we go. Important to notice. Would you like a new Uplay weapon that I apparently have because I apparently bought it on Uplay? That weird thing that exists for reasons. Let's see. A nice shotgun never hurts. AK-47s are nice. This thing has higher everything than the AK-47 though, so maybe I should move over to that thing. The STG-90? Why not? Let's give that a shot. Hello, scary. Maximum attachment uh, supported one. Now it's covered in sand. Don't have any upgrades for it though. Wait, I can't. I can't assign it to a slot. I have to equip it instead of a bow. All right. I'll be sure to swap it for the bow when needed though. Do I have upgrades to get? I can get a red eye slot. Uh, I can get red eye for bonus accuracy and mobility. And I can get bonus, I get extended mag. But both of them are expensive. In fact, everything's pretty expensive here, so I should probably stop. And maps. For 30,000 each, you can just buy a whole bunch of maps that tell you not only, I'm sure not only quick time events, I mean quick time, uh, quick travel locations, but I think they also tell you like all the collectibles in the entire game basically are on that screen, I believe. Molan Gale's journal. All right. One more for the next reward. Anything else around here? I just pressed triangle to look at my inventory based on a completely different game. Skills. Did I level up? Do I have points to spend? It cost me two things. I have one thing, so I can buy this first one, basically. So the op options are tiger and elephant. I believe those are... I think one of them is more stealth-oriented and one of them is more, like, action-oriented. I think basing on stat on stealth to some extent is probably more interesting. Death from below. Press R3 below one or two enemies on climbable ledges to take them down. That's nice. Elephant. Uh, extra health. That's probably not a bad thing to get early on. Huh. I took a pretty big hit early on. I think it's going to be worthwhile to grab the health upgrades since they're right there at the beginning of the... Uh, they're right there at the beginning anyway. 
At least the first couple or something. I mean, the first one only cost me one. We have a collection. We got Molangale's journal. So I think this is my dad, if I remember correctly. Or or at least it's the uh the what the husband of my mom. By shock, 1981. Ishwari and I were married today. The ceremony was small. Just her parents and mine. The village elders still believe it is a bad fortune to marry a Tarun uh, Matara, but I don't see it that way. She is charming and intelligent. Our marriage was arranged when we were children, years before her selection as Kira's vessel, and her dowry was paid by the temple. Money enough to set up my house, maybe even enough to buy a rice cooker, and my, tra and my transfer to the royal guards has been approved, so I'll be need new uniforms. Mohangale. It's always a good sign when you're thinking about your freaking... Ooh, skills. Why is that pop-up happening? Did I level up again? No, I didn't. Alright. Just slightly confusing me. So I can craft. For example, a wallet. Increases how much money you can carry. Or a weapon holster. Oh, carry one weapon of any type. There we go. Now I should be able to actually use that other weapon I had available to me. Let's see. Where are you at, bow? Bam! Sidearm only. Shit. Planned poorly. Well, I should get a sidearm then. Is the one of these is probably free, right? This one? There we go. And now we have a sidearm equipped. And that new slot I just crafted with those uh, wolf pelts. This one requires two barrel skin. Might as well. They all seem to require different types of animal skins anyway. Yeah. Might as well craft what I can then. Now we have an even bigger wallet. Yay! Because I'm so close to needing 500k. <laughs> What's that on the table here? More money. Get, please, country, just keep throwing more money at me. I'll stay here all you want. I'll buy all your trinkets. I don't think I want to need to sleep yet. Alright, Sabal. I think I patched things up with your friend. She seems happier to have me around at least. That's not you. You're in here, aren't you? <gasps> Give him some morphine! And turn off that fucking radio! What happened to him? He fell. Pagan floods the airways and we have to endure his bullshit. Enough is enough! I told him to climb up the old bell tower, take over the transmitters, hijack the broadcasts locally. Except... I can do it. Way to step up, brother. There's nobody guarding it, but it's a tricky climb. Promise me you won't fall. I promise. I won't. Way to step up, brother. Literally, because you're going to climb. Get it? Do you get it? Hey, you, you get it, you get it. Alright. Any ATVs around here? Hello, plants. Someone's working hard to farm here. I'm just gonna steal your stuff. Bye. I'm a good neighbor. ATV. Oh, hello. That's probably useful. Whoa, just randomly whip out your gun. Kind of ominous situation to do that in. You wanna talk? Good day. You wanna talk? You wanna talk? I just want to see if I can knock the box out of his hands because I'm a terrible person. Alright. Hope you guys aren't afraid of heights. I guess this game actually did come out at a similar time to Dying Light, didn't it? Oh. Definitely a reminder of that mechanic. Yeah. Of course, I think it was also in uh, Far Cry 3 anyway. Surely I can get in this, right? Yeah! This is safe. Go, auto drive, go! I believe in you. <laughs> Why wouldn't I? I'm just gonna look this way while we're driving. We'll be fine. Don't worry about it. The robot's got it. This is the magic of a self driving car. Are there bad guys around here? Hang on a second. By the way, I tried to rotate to the right instead of to the left. So I, I, was, I was trying to twist my head all the way around. Whoops. This is not how I get up there, is it? 
Looks like I'm going past it. Do I see a... Is there a map of the area that gives me topography at all? Ah! I said check the accident site. I think I was supposed to stop when I saw something back there. I'm sorry, it was the auto drive and I was looking backwards. So basically, it was really... It's completely my fault. You guys having a fight? Oh, hello. You guys need a lift? Or do you want to just take that one? I don't need it. You hit a you hit the boar. You wanna talk? Ew, you're just ripping guts out of them over and over again. Where are you putting those? They're just appearing and disappearing over and over again. It's a really freaky looking sight. Hey buddy. Why are you doing this? Oh, you react. Sorry. I had trouble acknowledging you as a human being because you were being doing weird things. I didn't know he was gonna just actually react. Whoopsie. I'm a crazy person. Sorry, just your wandering sociopath trying to get rid of his mother's ashes. I saw someone eat them earlier, so that was a good wake-up call for the morning. Are my ashes still on me? Wow, there are just dead people everywhere. You guys have a... Do you guys ever clean up bodies? It's gonna really start to stink here in about a day and a half. Alrighty then. I got this. Don't worry about it. Wow, he throws good. Is he like Superman? Maybe maybe everyone should be psyched to have him around. Maybe he is like the chosen one. Who's evil? No, I say that to my face. Where was that coming from? I don't actually know. Anyway, definitely want to go this way. Eh? Don't know if I can make that jump. Oh, can I? Oh, side grapple. This is where things get interesting. All right. Just gonna have to trust myself. Oh God. All right, I made it, it's fine. Give me your stuff. Cause I have no respect for the dead. Chewing gum, yummy. Cause I, I would love to have, eat candy I found on a corpse. Wee! He's progressed to being straight up Tarzan real quickly. Did he have secret military training? This is like an anchor point. Right, so that's an enemy soldier. Gonna want to be ready for him. Is there another one down there? Alright, hijack the signal. Boom! How do you like my knife? Propaganda bad. Yeah, fuck that poster. Anyone else around? Oh, there's a beehive. Probably could have knocked that down towards them if I was using a silent weapon, which I'm not at the moment. But he would have been in trouble. There we go. So I need to figure out how to get up to the top of the tower. Skills, did I level up? I shall sure did. Alright, let's do the death from below ability. Oops. Following skill requires death from above. Oopsie. Oh. You buy a two cost skill, then you buy a one cost skill. You have to start over here though. Interest. Oh, I can start all the way down here. Oh, you have access to everything immediately. Whoopsie. <laughs> I'm used to skill trees working differently than that. Uh, fire, aim and fire any sardine while moving a body. That's specific. Focus driving vehicles can take more damage before needing repairs. Back on the elephant side. Uh, gadget training, the speed and rip of repair tools greatly increased. Harvester, you're skillful and take twice as many leaves from each plant you harvest. Rhino skin. You take reduced damage from fire and explosive. Let's do the leaf thing. If it's a boost to all of my gathering, then getting it right at the beginning of the game seems like a smart move because it'll keep being a benefit for a while. Stay on target. And good sniper rifles can be reloaded while aiming. That's cool. I think I hear someone in here. Bell Towers. Reach the top to hijack Pagan Min's propaganda signal. Liberate. Oh, yeah, remove the fog from the map. It's the all. It's the Ubisoft game. Ubisoft the game. Every Ubisoft game. Climb a tower. Climb tower, reveal map. Climb tower, reveal map. 
They made a game called, I think it was called Drive Club was the one. It might have been a different one of the driving games. A lot of them came out. They were hard to keep straight. Drive Club might be the PlayStation exclusive one, not the Ubisoft one. I might be thinking of, I don't know, some other game. But the Ubisoft one... Where are you at, bro? Did he, did he say Encore? He wants an Encore? I'm happy to oblige, sir. Where are you? I just want to get a good look at your face. Just die already? You haven't even shot me yet. You got this, you got this, your order of operations is all fucked up. Hello. Health and safety warning. Pigman wishes you to remind you that bell towers of Carrot have been officially condemned. These dangerous ruins are a threat to the safety and well-being of everyone. Kingman has, in his benevolence, kindly stationed royal army troops at the towers to ensure safety of his loyal subjects. May Pagan's light shine upon you all. The Ministry of Public Affairs and Social Harmony. Yeah, that's how I would describe his general behavior. Let's be very careful. Where is he? Where is this guy? He's really mad at me, but I don't know where he is. Oh, I can break that. Cool. Good job. He's really good at that, too. This guy has a lot of good life skills. Where is this guard hanging out? Alright, just keep climbing. I'm going to drag you out by your That's rude. You wanna re you wanna rephrase that maybe? There's no reason for this lack of civility. Does he even know where I am, or is he just yelling in general? Maybe he found the body and he just started yelling about it. But yeah, whatever the driving game was by Ubisoft last year, that game also featured uh, using radio towers to reveal the map, even though you don't get out of your car. I think you would like hack them or something. Where is he? Is he all the way on top? Loot. Got pliers, yeah. <laughs> That's one way to take care of it, I guess. Just like that, this big mountainous area filled with animals and trees that's kind of hard to get a good feeling for suddenly has several new locations unlocked. It also has a map of like the wildlife you can go find around here if you're trying to kill specific wildlife to hunt for certain uh, craftable upgrades. That's how you do it, basically. Vehicle. Oh, no, that, uh, oh, Golden Path Supplies. Collect scattered supplies and deliver them to the Golden Path in this quest. Awards experience in rupees. So there's collectibles just around, too. Where's that guy? He's trying to get weirded out by the fact that I haven't seen him, because he seemed real mad at me. I like my character's hacking strategy. It's just to just, just, just hit the thing really hard with a machete and flip some levers. See what happens. You can't make it worse, right? This place is already pretty fucked. Can I... Oh, that was a zip line, wasn't it? Do I already have another upgrade point? I think I do. Yep, one more. Let's see. So I can go for moving target, focus driving. I wasn't... Let's see. Hunting syringe. This syringe highlights enemies and animals last 30 seconds. Interesting. I don't think I necessarily want to spend any, buy anything out of my current options. I'd rather save the point for now. Alright, good progress. I think we're probably going to uh, end the episode here. Warp back to town and see if, if, if new quests show up as a result. Thanks for watching, guys. Like always, I'll see you next time. And if you're a Patreon supporter, be sure to to weigh, <laughs> to weigh in on that poll about whether you want me to focus on the main story or do a bunch of side stuff, and whether or not we, we're going to try to finish this game this month or spend a lot of time on it, potentially. Or any There's details in the email. Thanks for watching, guys. Like always, and I'll see you next time. I already said that, and I've already said that in the past, too, because I'm good at saying that I've already said things. Yeah. Archie, it's a bar. Good work on the tower, brother. We're broadcasting on its frequency and bringing the truth to the people. When you have time, go see Longinus. He's a friend of the Golden Path and he'll be grateful you helped us. Longinus? Weapons dealer and priest. A little crazy, but if you want guns, he's the man to see. I'll update your map.